Sars Wagon. Uh, well, let's play Sars Wagon with the, de uh, with, the with the developers. I'm Piru or Alejandro. I'm the producer and developer of Stars Wagon. This is the second uh, session of Let's Play. We're doing um, a session each week on Monday until we release the game on the Sura on uh, May 31st. So this is the second uh, live session here on Twitch. We'll, we'll be doing another um, two sessions. There are two sessions left. So in the previous session, we were playing the story mode um, and we uh, reached level eight which is the next counter. So the idea for this uh, session, obviously, if there's only anyone watching or if, if you have any questions regarding um, the, the game or the game development experience experience or, or process, please ask. Um, here we are to play the game, answer questions, uh, or do a Q&A, obviously, and um, yeah, to show you the game most of all. So let, let, let's start. So yeah, uh, as I was saying um, just moments ago before we started the session, um, on the story mode we have two different type uh, types of um, game game modes. So we have the time-based game modes and the encounter ones with boss fights, boss battles. So the time-based game mode is based on a timer. So when the timer ends, the game, the level, I mean you you clear the stage. So regardless of how you did or whatever, obviously if you run out of health, you die and you lose the game, or the level in this case. And the other ones with this start, the star obviously, the star icon, it, these, these are uh, boss fights. So I'm going to start with the, the timer on, on the phone. So okay, let's start with level 8. Okay, so it says, look live, cadet. It's time to learn the basics. Oh no no I'm not on the tutorial. Oh my god I'm starting the tutorial. Sorry for the for that. Let's quit quit the tutorial. Wait. Oh wow. Okay sorry for that. We already did the tutorial. We don't want to do the tutorial again. Okay say so buckle up soldier. Our spies confirm the presence of the shallow horn. So that's the name of the next of this this new bold boss battle. This is no ordinary foe. Find its weakness and liberate the Federian galaxy once and for all. Okay, so let's do it. So um, we're still using two different um, colors, right? Green and purple. So okay, since we are battling a boss, we want to be. Uh, we don't want to spend as much bullets as possible. We want. We want to keep as much bullets as possible. And one of the, the things is that if you destroy an enemy uh, that is, I don't know, purple or green, it will explode and will give you, in this case, um, uh, arms or color arms, which you can use to add more ammo or more bullets to your stock. So another thing important is that there's a difference between the, 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 bullet, the colored of bullets. So if you notice, the, the green bullet will be slower than the purple bullet. I don't I know you, you saw that, but the purple was a lot more, more, more faster. So as the game progresses, you'll see that we'll, we will be adding more colors and more uh, speed to the game. Not only to the to the bullets, but to the game itself. I mean, uh, asteroids will be faster, the enemies will be faster. Okay, we reached uh, the, the boss fights. So, here you have to use uh, a lot of things or a lot of the game mechanics that the game has. In this case, obviously, switching colors and uh, try to avoid, avoid, sorry, and use the, the first. So the first thing you'll notice is that there's no, uh, we, we haven't seen any weak ooh, we haven't seen any weakness on the game on, on the boss fight. I mean, it's not indicating us what color to use. That's because these are there are these to to turrets above that we need to destroy first. So the first thing that we need to do is destroy the, the turrets. So we'll see that after that the boss uh, will reveal the, the color, the, their weakness, his weakness. Oh my god, I shoot the wrong color. So yeah, look how I'm doing this. So you have to be very precise. You have to shoot the guy and do the burst in the right moment to, to escape. Uh, because I think this guy will keep, uh, will, will, I mean if he hits you, he will take Half of, uh, half of your uh, health. So th it looked easy, but that's because I played this level a lot. I tested a lot of times, but it's hard actually the first time you do it. Okay, so we finish, we kill the Shadow Horn. So it says, next level, level 9. 
their job is not completely done, soldier. I don't know if you noticed, but the shadow horn had a new color in the, it had a, a color in his back. That's because we unlocked the third color. In this case, the blue uh, orb. So we're going to play with three colors this time. The Minus, the Minos asteroid field is serving as a hidden, hidden base, sorry, for the Dark One's fleet. Make a surprise visit and cut their numbers down. So this is a time-based level that we're going to play. You see, uh, we have a new color over here, and and obviously enemies are shooting faster now. That's hotter. And but I want to know why is what is more hotter? Having to switch between three different colors. Now, since this is not a based uh, base level, I mean, I mean a boss battle base level, we can shoot what uh, as much as possible. We can empty our, our ammo stock doesn't matter we can and we can aim for a better uh, better score because obviously well if you have a lot of ammo at the end of the game the game will give you a bonus but destroying things will give you points as well and it's not that it's not also important because it gave you points but because look at this the, the game right now the world is pretty much overwhelming with asteroids and things and you need to uh, avoid in this case but what you can do actually instead of a bowie of a bowie is clear, clearing the stage a little bit clearing the map a little bit shooting things shooting things and, and uh yeah clearing the stuff okay so let's go and kill this guy oh and we cleared the level this was very easy yeah but there are people that are not able or this, that this level is harder for them so are there people in the chat? No, they're not. Let me see. Close this. I don't see no one in the chat. Is this because? Okay. Let's see. So let's go back to the next level. Okay, so says level 10. Now we have another encounter here. This is the fifth boss battle, right? You were supposed to restock at the bike Barca system, but there's something blocking all communications. Something big. Be cautious. Be cautious. Ca cautious, soldier. This universe holds many secrets. Try to make contact with the Burka, however, you can. Okay, so this is the this is actually kind of a surprise because in the in the trailer we made and all the gameplay sessions we made we haven't showcased this boss fight yet so be prepared okay so uh, same as the previous level here in this level we obviously have um, five different colors to play with so the game mechanics uh, are more difficult with this this time around. So, what will happen in the next levels? How difficult might be the next levels? Well, you will see. We have kind of uh, little surprises for the next levels. So, uh, same thing as I mentioned previously. Since this is a boss uh, boss fight kind of level, you might want to try to keep as much as bullet bullets as possible. So. Uh, so let's see how much I can keep and that uh, the enemies are man they're shooting a lot of things at the moment okay actually I need more no I can what I can do and I'm not doing if I oh my god if I destroy one of these ships they will pop into more orbs color orbs and obviously these color orbs will give you uh, ammo so let's see uh oh, this that's the boss. We're going to encounter that boss. That's the Shadow Fleet. So yeah, the Shadow Fleet has this. Uh, what is this called? Like shield that we need to destroy first. So let's see. Depending on the color, oh my God, we missed that. Okay, 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 okay. And then we need to destroy the turrets. It's not that harder. Ah, uh, I need to play with colors first. Whoa, 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 oh, they got me. Oh, no, I cannot die with this devil, right? So we should.
shoot on one guy. I think we destroyed the first, the first turret. Let's destroy the second one. We did the third one. We did it. Oh my god. We did it. Okay, next level. And did I high score over there? Yeah, obviously it was the first time we are playing this level. Okay, so it says that Galactic Colossus. Oh, wait, wait, no, sorry, it was not the Shadow Blade. It was the Col Galactic Colossus, the name of the boss fight. Okay, it says Galactic Colossus was no easy task, soldier. Communication with uh, Burkia has been restored. Your, your next objective is quite far away. Navigate with caution. caution. The Colossus explosion sent flying thousands of, of containers. Use them to your advantage. So this is important. We're going to see one of the items that we have. Uh, one of the, or I can say, the cards that we have for the for, for making the game more viable. We can say. So let's start. So the containers, as they say, they. Con there are containers flying around and they contain obviously bullets and they can be they can be a pain in the ass you don't have the correct color to, to destroy them and to get the the, 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 the correct um, orbs inside of them and I will I, I will show you why I will try to destroy this with the wrong color I will try to hit them with the wrong color look how much health I'm going to lose a lot of health and that's because we're not only you I mean we're not only um, hitting the, the, the container but we're also hitting the orbs inside of it so we have to be very careful what color or, or a, what color we have selected for our ship otherwise we're going to get a lot of health uh, we're going to drop a lot of health just for trying to pick up the, one of those containers now another cool stuff you can do is to actually use the birds to your advantage uh, when trying to get this and uh, because I mean they explode and when they explode the containers will I mean drop or uh, throw the the orbs or in, in different right directions you can use like, like how, how I did uh, I mean you can use the birds to do what I, what I just did right um, shoot the, the container use the burst and grab all the orbs right away so that was kind of easy that it was I mean these timer based uh, levels are preparing ourselves or are preparing us for the next level so this next level is is, is really cool it's difficult you have to be very focused it says the dark ones are getting serious the stinger fleet has been sighted Stinger Fleet, that's the name of the boss. In the Siren, Syrian Asteroid crust, uh, Cluster. Make sure to stock up on stock, uh, stock up on ammo when facing it. This won't be a smooth ride. So, okay, so it's very easy what we have to do. And you will see the game changes a lot. I think you will not see as much as asteroids as uh, we saw in previous uh, levels. And actually, um, I don't think there are enemies at all. So only what we have here is full, full, um, in this case, full containers. So the whole idea is to grab as much as uh, as much bullets as possible because we're going to use a lot of bullets in the in the, in the, in the boss fight. So I'm missing green green bullets. So let's try to grab as much as possible over here. So, you see I'm using the burst to help myself uh, to grab all the stuff in the container. So that's very important. That's something that you have to use and you have to be very careful because look at that. I almost hit a container just trying to grab one of these um, uh, containers. Or trying to use sorry, the burst to grab a container. So yeah, in this level there are no enemies at all. But only the containers make it challenging, make it challenging enough, you know? Let's see. Okay, how much bullets we have? Okay, we have a lot of blue bullets. Okay, let's try to grab green ones. We have not too many green bullets. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, wow. Okay, we're 
doing fine, just fine. Okay, we, I think the enemies about to come. Yep, I hear them. Okay, so look at the enemy. I don't know if you can see, but there's a yellow bullet, a uh, yellow orb in the, in, beside him. So if we destroy this guy, we'll be able to get the, the, the yellow orb. Okay, yeah! Nice! We kill it. It's not difficult, it looks very, very easy, but that's because I have a lot of... I mean, I, I play this game a ton, so that's why I know how to beat this guy, you know? Okay, let's continue. Let's see, it says level 13. We are almost reaching the end of the story mode, so be prepared. The Marion system is the last place on the second this sector to report activity from the Dark Ones. We are close to winning this battle. Threat likely and counter all attacks. So get ready guys, because I think uh, we're going to play this level and we're going to yeah, we're going to play this level, and we're going to keep the last, um, the last boss fight for next week. Okay, let's see how it goes. So look at this. Uh, we no longer have the green bullet. We and now we have the, the the yellow one, and it's faster than all the bullets that we previously have or had. Sorry. And you can see that the enemies are also powerful enough. There, there should bullets faster and they have formation so everything is kind of hard kind of harder if not ready in this at this moment, moment on the story mode okay oh let's see let's see I, wow look at my health if i'm not careful enough i will die we don't want to die right now we have to finish this game seconds on the go almost about to end Let's see oh, look at this I want to do something ah, die that look cool right yeah depending how fast you you shoot your you press your buttons you can do this that look cool oh yeah and I run out, out of bullets so that's not as that is fun, but not as efficient as I as as I want to be fun. But it will be. Okay, done. The stage clear, guys. The stage clear. Okay. So uh, we're going to quit this. We are almost about to end the story mode. So, obviously, I'm not going to play this mode this week. I'm going to leave it for next week. So, any questions you have for uh, surrounding the game, uh, prepare them for next week. Uh, we'll be answering those questions if you have any doubts or any questions regarding the game, game development. As I mentioned before, the game was developed with Unity 3D in a time of two weeks, something like that. And not two weeks, sorry, two months. Um, we launched this game previously on, on mobiles, but the ultimate version of the game, which is this one, the standalone edition, I'm playing this with a controller though, uh, is going to be released on the Sura on May 31st. So, please, if you want to see uh, the previous uh, session of, the, of Twitch, please go ahead, check out your uh, our YouTube channel. We already exported this uh, that session to YouTube, so you can check it out. Take, take note, uh, see um, the whole gameplay, the, the whole campaign, right? And the, the game, only the story mode is roughly about an hour of gameplay. Uh, depending on how good you are, you can maybe complete it in 40 minutes. But yeah, it's, it's about an, an hour of gameplay. You cannot beat it in less than that. Or yeah, sorry, you can beat it in less than that, I already say that. Uh, but yeah, it's roughly one hour. That's only the, the, the story mode. But obviously we have the challenge modes with, I think it could take you about half an hour, maybe um, another an hour perhaps of, of gameplay. So this, this game is worth uh, two, two hours, depending if you want to challenge yourself because each, each level, once you, I mean, once you create an account, you can uh, challenge other, each level has 
its own leaderboards. So you can challenge people uh, from uh, different platforms, right? Uh, say Linux, Mac, or Windows, and for a high score. So after you beat the game, you can, if you want, you like the game, you like the mechanics, you like the, the certain levels, certain boss fights, you can challenge your friends, you can challenge the community, and uh, for a better score. So, okay, I uh, hope you guys like this session. We're ending the session right now, and we're going to continue story mode next week, in which we're going to finish story mode, uh, the, the, the last boss, which is, the for me, the best boss battle in the whole game. It's super fun to play, and it's very challenging. And then we're going to play, start playing the challenges, which, which is another mode that is really cool. It could be a separated game by its own. So I hope uh, you guys like this session. Uh, sorry for the um, audio from the previous, uh, the previous session or last week. Uh, okay, guys. Uh, see you next time. Stay tuned. Uh, we're going to start we're, after we finish this um, session. We're going to uh, export this to YouTube, so you can take uh, take a look on on this session past uh, previous sessions and if you're seeing this like I don't know um, in the past you will see you will be able to see the other the, the further transmissions so thanks for watching and any questions you have just uh, reach us over social media okay stay tuned bye bye hey.